This is the daily video update for Friday, October 22nd, 2021. For the Unitarian Church of Lincoln, I'm the Reverend Oscar Sinclair. When you walk into our church now, you're greeted with a uh, beautiful stained glass window um, in memory of Mary Manell. The stained glass window has been in our basement for as long as I've been here at this church, but within the last month, um, members from the congregation installed it uh, near our entrance. And the story, since, since we've installed it, a bunch of people have asked who Mary Manell was. So here's the story again, and it's also where we'll, we'll pick up on Sunday. In 1870 or thereabouts, a traveling universalist evangelist um, came through the then new town of Lincoln and preached a couple of universalist sermons in the then under construction state capitol building. There were enough people interested that they raised the money and, uh, and interest for a universalist congregation in Lincoln, Nebraska. And then that traveling evangelist took the money and moved to California with it. Over the next three or four years, a woman named Mary Manell spearheaded an effort first to get that money back, and then when that didn't happen, to defrock that traveling evangelist, and in the meantime, re-raise the money and the interest for a Universalist chapel in Lincoln, Nebraska. She is in many ways the founding figure of the congregation, not a, a preacher or not a, not a uh, professional, but a lay person who was convinced by the, the message of Universalism that this needed to be a piece of who we are uh, in, in this town for the last 150 years. This Sunday we're talking about covenant, and we're talking about covenant in particular um, over time, what it means to be a part of a community that spans generations and to, to be in a very real way um, the, the inheritors of Mary Manell's legacy we're also welcoming new members into the congregation this Sunday as a way to point not just back in time to the people that have been a part of this community, but also forward in time to the, the community that this will continue to be and the relationships that we continue to cultivate in it. I hope you'll come out. Um, we've got a registration link in this in the e-blast that went out today, and, uh, and we will be in person and singing on Sunday morning. See you there.